Oh, that's us. What is that? Not dented. But it does look like. Oh no, wait. I reckon. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah, it's part of a quest somewhere down the line. Not an important one, but. Eh. V. There was a massacre over at Longshore Stacks. Residents murdered by one Leon Rinder, a long-serving ex-Vargas ghoul. Naturally, the victim's families want him found and appropriately dealt with. Head down there and find Brianna Dolson, the stack's unofficial representative. She'll fill you in. Happy hunting. Those conversation roots are at it again remember 75 wasn't as bad as this but they killed two kids then no apology no compensation nothing yo keep it down no i'm done being scared of them people died and you're out here oh, sorry for interrupting name's v hand sent me brianna i take it that's right martha this woman here She'll help us. We'll give you some space. Okay? Yes. Go. Sorry. Emotions are running high right now. Before we start, need to understand who you are. Where from. Life in Dogtown? Know it well? Spent years working for Arasaka. Here shaved off my life working for a corp. But Dogtown only exists because someone stands to profit. It's a combat zone, not a place to raise a family. Folks are here because they got nowhere else to go. That's you introduced. I'm Brianna. Six years back, the Tigers came after me, so I ran. Landed here. For most of us, our past doesn't amount to more than that. Running, surviving. Which is why I want to make sure that for once, the eddies we scraped together will buy us justice. Real justice. Justice means what to you, exactly? Definitions vary. Want to hear your take? Leon Rinder doesn't deserve to live. He was a triggerman for Hansen. A murderer. All too familiar with that brand of justice. Good for you. Doesn't change Rinder killing Martha's son, Jason, along with his friends and four other residents. Jason, Caleb, Deontay, Omar, Pharrell, Matthias, Elisa, and Tamika. Why would Rinder be meeting with Jason? Any idea? All I know is that Jason was supposed to put Rinder in touch with the Scavs. Scavengers. Jason happened to be involved in some unsavory biz. He was a young man trying to get by in Dogtown. Wasn't no angel, but his heart was in the right place. Martha made sure of that. Rinder's not a Bargas soldier anymore. Why? 
no clue. All I know is he's brutal, cold-blooded, a beast. What's his connection to Hansen? He joined when Hansen set up shop in Dogtown. Carried out orders no one else dared take, according to rumor. Why kill all these people? Any reason? Evil is evil. It doesn't need a reason. Martha's boy, Jason, he wanted to become a fixer. He set up some deal, brought Rinder to the stacks. But there was a dispute. Rinder opened fire and, well, was still scrubbing the blood off the walls. Identified the bodies by their implants. I see. Found this in Jason's body. It's encrypted, but I'm sure you can manage. Feel free to look around, investigate. There's still plenty of traces. Taxes, who the fuck needs them? Grinder will get what's coming to him. I'll make sure of it. I can tell that to Jason's mother. Good, I will. Now you know what we've been through, V. Don't let us down. Can count on me. Grinder's dog tag. Bring it to me. It'll serve as a reminder to this pack of thugs that we're capable of fighting back. But you're sending me to fight him. I'll do my best. Okay. Okay, BD, 1C, 1C. Fifty-five. Cell combat implants. Militech third gen. Good condition. Los Osos motor. Makarov? I just realized the name is Makarov. Got some Call of Duty Modern Warfare flashbacks. The old ones. When he was actually a threat. Ah. Huh? Okay, that was weird. Combat souls? Must have run up, boosted onto the roof of this shack, bashed his leg against the railing. That's a That's huge a foot. Ten foot jump for a man who's got to weigh at least 360 pounds, leaving dino prints like these. So either we're witnessing the fattest fuck who ever jumped, or Rinder's got augmented hamstrings on top of being crumbed up like a goddamn tank. Is a riddle, all right. Why is the car relevant? Smoking? Okay. Nothing else. Ah. <laughs> Damaged by a heavy, fast moving object. So he's built like the character I built earlier in my other playthrough. Marks like these. I'm thinking 50 cal rounds, Mark 31 HMG. Heavier than a motherfucker lead spitter that did this. Hauling it with a Gannick arm? Not a chance. Classic go to for Militech Marines. Ex soldiers like Rinder. Scan did pick up traces of other rounds, which would make him the lone shooter. Someone's been collecting different kinds of lead here. Why? When I was little, after shootouts, we'd race to collect any casings we could find. Traded them between ourselves. 
Must be some kid's stash. Doesn't tell me anything about Rinder, but... Can't complain about knowing a little piece of Johnny Silverhand's childhood. <laughs> like a pseudo-currency. Mm, a pile of scrap. Probably laying here for weeks. What else is there? Oh, here yeah. Trying to take it out on the ground or something? Not his fist. See the blood? Indentation? Took some poor fucker's head and bashed it. Repeatedly. It's like he went berserk. Seems you're looking for a borged out killing machine that's lost all self-control. Sounds about right. Hmm. Right, to the motel. <laughs> So it sounds like he's gone cyber psycho. Now was that a result of his cyber psychosis or was it just because he was an asshole even before he was a cyber psycho? Right, so I've run into a problem. Every time I activate my hacks and infect everyone there, it is causing the game to crash when I get into that building. I don't know why, because it's not done that before. So, I think I'm going to have to refrain from using my hack for now. I really don't know what's going wrong. This is my third time now. Not this time. Now go on, get out of here. You know, just to be safe, instead of walking all the way to this fast travel thing, I'm just going to save it here as a quick save, and immediately going to kill this guy. I swear if it crashes again. I'm inside now. I hope it doesn't crash. That's a toilet. That looks like the kitchen from Jurassic Park. What do you think you're doing? Stop. Okay, so far so good. That's the furthest I've made it in. What are you doing here? God, I hate scabs. They're such evil people. 
It's almost a pleasure to make them suffer. Okay, it's upstairs. What? What is that? Organic food continues to be a major cause of cause of cause of Stings. Almost fresh. Looks like they carved someone up here recently. Guts on the walls, blood on the floor, optical on the table. Interior decoration. Scav edition. Was that a trail? Minus. Oh, negative. Sorry. Hey, I'm O negative. Time to die. What the? Shit. Alright, big guy. I kill you. Me first. Big guy. Did you detonate them on yourself? Where's this guy? I lost him. Shit.
He's right there. Oh, you're his bodyguard, huh? <laughs> what does that say about him? Hey, hey, relax, Trum. Let's talk this through. Not about to off an unarmed man, are you? Grinder? Thought you'd look different. More chromed. I'm Rinder, all right, or at least what's left of him. Guessing you're here on contract. Hansen sent you? I'm here in the name of those people you killed at the stacks. What? Hold on. The stacks? Uh, I was there. Someone tried to rip me off, but I, I didn't kill no one. I I've got these. Blackouts ain't always present. I'm sick, okay? Sounds like you know more than me. You and Hansen, what happened? Left you on the rocks? You got eyes? Toss me to rot in the gutter. My tombs too. Eight years I gave that asshole. Eight years. Kid enlisted at 20. Had no excuse. Fuck did he think it happened? Stuffing himself with combat wear like a pinata. Matter of time before he burst. You let scabs carve you up like a Thanksgiving turkey. Why? Cause I told him to. What do you think? Sold him my chrome. Might be twisted fucks, but they keep their word. Now you're gonna tell me that that hulking slab of scab that came at me was your ripper? That bumbling buffoon? Just proof they can't guard for shit. You killed that kid, Jason. Along with seven others. Why? What for? I'm sick, all right? I wanted to pawn my chrome, collect enough scratch to get treated. Jason was my go-between with the local scavs. And here you are. Meaning he did his part. Except you tried to give me the Dogtown shakedown first. Started waving his big dick iron. Fucking savage. And then... I... I can't remember. Rippers in Dogtown. None of them could help? Say what's ailing you? If they did, think I'd have myself gutted like a fish? Ripping out third-gen combat wear and tripping myself with crooked chrome for what? Shits and gigs? I was there. Savage what you did. Makes you the savage. Fuck you want me to say? That I admit to all the sins I committed? Remembered, forgotten, and all in between? Fine. I regret it, okay? I regret all the years with Hanson. Joined up when I was just a kid. Kept my head down, followed orders, whatever I did. I'm sorry. As if you know shit about Dogtown anyhow. Dogtown chewed him up, shat him out. Place must be packed with hapless turds like him. Be simpler if it was all Hansen's fault. But that ain't how it works. Tell me, what don't I know about Dogtown? It wasn't Scavs tried to fuck me over. It was that shit weasel Jason. Dogtown's teeming with filth like him. Makes Bargus look good in comparison. You see how they live in those cargo containers? Bunch of fucking savages. Can't have folks leaving either, no, uh? Want you to rot right there beside him. Really? So you say sorry, I forgive you, and then what? You go on your merry way, off some more peeps? How? 
What with? Fucking look at me! Look at me! What else have I got to lose, huh? They fucked me over, all of them! I used to be a soldier. Look at me now! Had heaps of time to walk away before you dove off the deep end. I was 20, okay? Put my faith in Hansen. Wasn't the first or last. I make everything my fucking fault now? And those whiny bitches I dropped at the stacks? Fuck them! Fuck Dogtown! I'd burn this shithole to the ground if I could, along with everyone in it! Better choose your next words carefully. Listen to me, just listen! I'm expired goods, a walking corpse. I can't decommission me more than this. Tell him Leon Reinder's dead, and <laughs> you wouldn't even be lying. Do that? The gear I stashed, it's yours. Or no, fuck! I won't beg. Shoot if you want. Fairly easy decision. How quickly can switch up like that? That guy was unstable. He was a danger to every single person around him. Time to deliver the dog tags. put this into my other character but <laughs> they did something really stupid they kept like it says that the capacity can go all the way up here right but for some reason it just caps there i hope they fix that in the ne in whatever update they come because i want to max out this it's just gonna leave this and it's not gonna mean anything let me rephrase that I, I, I... see it caps around 350, which is somewhere around here. But clearly, it can go further. But they out of they've. Uh, I think uh, the latest update capped it, so it can't go maximum, which doesn't make sense. Why would you cap when there's already a cap? Right? Stupid. Stupid. The game is a challenge for most of it, at least until you get good cyberware. And isn't that the whole point? You're supposed to feel like an unstoppable force by the end of the game? A mad cyborg? Would have been cool, but no. Balancing in a game that's single player clearly encourages you get to extreme cyberware. See, it worked in Witcher because it was balanced. Yeah, who's this now? Oh, it's that lady we saw. Not oh, lady we saw. So we saw a house. Stupid thing. Right. Oh. It's done. Reinder's dead. You didn't let us down, did you? Found Reiner in Pacifica. Dealt with him. And the son of a bitch got what he deserved. 
On behalf of all the residents of the Stacks, thank you. It's the least I could do. All right. That sorted. V, the target. Is he terminated? Took care of him. Congratulations, then. Contract closed. V, in Luxor Heights, there's a... Let's call it a sports academy. Clients from all around the world come there to seek fresh talent. Contracts are signed while taxes allegedly go unpaid. What did I do? It so happens that my client doesn't like people who cut corners. With my Netrunner's help, you'll enter the facility and extract the data that's of import to my client. Godspeed. Well, uh, well all right. Let's get this started. This is a slightly disturbing quest. A subject matter rather than violence, actually. Okay. Your hands murk, right? How much you know about the job? Eh, not much. Hands mentioned something about athletes and peeps evading taxes. Here's the sitch. At this academy, they're training, molding young athletes. Folks flying from across the world to meet them, sign contracts. You're going in as a scout for the San Diego Shredders. Name's Victoria Wilson, 28, and you're looking for a wide receiver. Scheduling you in their system now. You following all this? Got it. San Diego Shredders, Victoria Wilson, 28 years old. Looking for a wide receiver. Well done. Just remember to keep a tight lip, no unnecessary chatter. Once you're in, find Fiona Varga's office, the Academy's director, and pull data on every scout who's ever signed a contract. Questions? What's a sports academy doing in Dogtown? Ah, they're all over the world. They make athletes stronger, better. But if you want to enhance them earlier than the legal age limit, where would you go? Where no one gives a shit. Or as it's more commonly known, Dogtown. Whatever Hansen says, goes. And nobody gives a fuck about the rest. Oh shit. The uh, cover story's a little thin. Ought to flesh it out, don't you think? No need. It's your way in, nothing more. Beyond that, avoid any talk about yourself. Just blend in, get the data, and get out. Hands a tax collector now? Yeah, I ain't buying it. How about shitload of Eddie's collector? Sound more believable? Job isn't glamorous, but it pays. Arasaka demons? Not easy to come by. How'd you know they're Arasaka? Ex counter intel. Third branch. Ex cybersec. First. Looks like we both took a wrong turn somewhere. Sorry. I'm Baird. V. Okay. Quick scan and... We're in. System recognized you. Should be able to waltz straight in. Good luck. Alright. I think I'd best look the part, huh? Stylish suit? Oh god. Uh... Nope. Damn it. Okay, get rid of that. And... Ah, oh, for God's sake. There we go. Suit I wore at the other place. Should blend in properly. At least for now. Mrs. Wilson, if you'll join me, please. Oh, uh, what is it? Everything you see here is protected under an NDA. Should any information about our athletes be made public, 
Our contract with the Diego Shredders will be terminated, effective immediately. Ouch, sounds serious. If I may, I suggest you start your visit at our world-class bar. Drinks are on the house. Well then, got my first mission for you. Need you to neutralize three shots of tequila, stat. Who's using these bots? Our verbal motor integrated interface is used by scouts such as yourself remotely from Asia, Europe, Africa. Since not everyone can make a personal appearance in Dogtown, we've provided a solution. I'd like to speak with Dr. Fiona Vargas in private. Hmm. Without an appointment, I'm afraid that won't be possible. All right then. Seen athletes, v. They're kids. Kids way too young for this kind of crow. See that, Johnny? Ladies and gentlemen, the next we junior for the 2077-2078 season is Katie McCannon. Synoptic accelerator bionic lungs? What the hell? See every spot on the other side with your name on it. They just Katie gave her like adult cybernetics. Top scoring position. So stupid. She's equipped with permanently reinforced ACLs and both right excellent quadricep growth. Our next athlete, whom you'll have the pleasure of meeting, is Kelvin Golden Strickland. Can Kelvin I get a double a shot of since on tequila? With an instant there you knockout go. punch. First time I take it. Which team you scouting for? All those interested in signing with Kelvin, please feel Rather free drink to than chat. his performance statistics. What the? What the? That was tempered class. Oh, and I wouldn't give and there's that knockout punch, punch I was talking Sorry, about. Sorry, I have to close the bar Forgive for a second. Forgive me, ladies and gentlemen, but due to damaged equipment, this athlete showcases on... Now's our chance to sneak behind the scenes of this fucking circus. Don't know if I'm gonna like what I see. The Sawfire. Got it. What? And I'm in. What's that? Labs. Okay. Net runner. mission has a better outcome if it's dealt, so, yeah. Oh great, now he's halfway outside. I 
bartender. It's a bartender? <laughs> Were you the one who just served me? Sorry, man. No, the other one had darker hair. you have here open surveillance system off piano's office okay Okay, not that way. That's to the outside. Off. This, this little thing reminds me of Metal Gear Solid. off ability evaluations such small kids and experimenting on them not experimenting but you know like giving them cybernetics like my kind of cybernetics this won't trigger anything right Is that it? It's got a fridge there, but I already put the body somewhere. His impact strength is off the chart. The training these kids get here, state of the art. Huh? 
the elevators. It doesn't go where I want it to. That is insane. How do I get past you? I think that was something. Not gonna worry about your friend disappearing, right? Situation's under control. I guess you really didn't like each other either. Okay, so far so good. Authorization. Cameras are off. They're gonna wonder where everyone went. <laughs> Ali, certified pro grade athlete. Hello? Whoa! You scared me. Uh, sorry, didn't mean to. Hmm, let me guess. You're with the team. Here to pick me up? Which team? Uh, the Atlanta Wolves. Duh! I'm gonna be their new pitcher. Oh. Uh, so that means you're not here for me. Who brought you here? Who? Me! I applied! I was chosen! The look on Mom's face when I told her I'm leaving Eugene to become a pro? <laughs> she was so proud. Your mom, huh? Don't you miss her? Sometimes, but only a little. And I try not to, because... because I'm strong. How are you holding up? Everything all right? Ah, oh, not this again. I already had a talk with that shrink this week. I've said all there is to say. What you reading? A biography of Diamond Day, my favorite basketball player who was born right here in Dogtown. Did you know she trained with... Now, if you'll excuse me, miss, I'm on a tight training schedule. Goodbye. Are these kids acting like modern-day athletes? What the hell? What's that mean? Hmm. That, I don't know, that immediately made me think of Breaking Bad. <laughs>
I saw his name. Darn it. It's got... I... I was just looking for a... It's all right. What's your name? Tommy. How do you get in here? They let you out of your room? Well, I know a few tricks. My dad's a techie. He taught me a ton of stuff. Hi, Tommy. My name's V. What you doing here? Uh, nothing. I'm just kind of here. In the director's office? Come on. I know you were looking for something. Yeah, sort of wanted to see if I got picked for a team. But still no one. It's not fair. I've got all the right skills. The right chrome. I'm super duper fast. Your day will come. Just takes time. That's all. It's just... well... I'm getting old. You? Old? Soon no one will want me. Not even the worst teams. Dad said I can't screw up because we live in Dogtown and... career in sports is our last chance. Tough having that responsibility. But if it wasn't for your family... What would you want? Uh, have some fun, I guess. Or take a vacation. <laughs> That'd be neat. You're a good kid, Tommy. Know that? I know. Hey, chin up, kiddo. It'll all work out, you'll see. Say, little whiz like you wouldn't know where Fiona's terminal is, would you? Need it for a sec. It's right there. Can't you see? What would you look at that? Silly old me. See? I know everything. Yeah. <laughs> Clever little rascal. Now buck up and get out of here before Miss Fiona sees you. Yes, ma'am. I, I just need to find, uh, uh, that thing. Okay, Tommy. Hey. These kids. I'm so sorry for them. Tommy, out now. Wait, uh, she was just looking for your office. Uh, I, I was just trying to help. Uh, please, Miss Fiona. Leave the boy out of this, please. Run along now, Tommy. Hop to it. But I didn't do nothing wrong. It's all right, Tommy. Go back to your room. I'd like to see her justify We're this. We're reasonable people. I'm sure we can work something out. What is it you want? Password to the terminal, and the data of every suit you've done biz with. Transactions, contracts, agreements, whole enchilada. Uh, what do you intend to do with it? Got it backwards. I'm the one asking questions. I have a duty to protect my business and my clients. You understand that, I'm sure. Business? <laughs> The fucking gall. Think of the children. Would you really deprive them of their only chance for a better just life? Just gets better and better, this bitch. If you please, just hear me out. I'd like to make you an offer. I'll make you a counteroffer. Oh? Get fucked. Finally. <laughs> so what else did she have? Yeah, she was an awful person. She's got a bunch of cyberware hanging out. Okay. You know, in my other playthrough with the uh, with the body build character, 
the one with gorilla arms. I need to show you all that. I already finished everything in that uh, profile. I like grabbed her and I just threw her around until her body shattered. Which is kind of morbid, but... Anyway. She kind of deserved that. They do this to kids. Give them false hope. Then just take their money too, huh? Chipping kids there? Why so dramatic? It's an open secret by now. Everyone knows what goes on there. Few care. If I've offended your sense of moral decency, I do apologize. Contract closed. Until the next time, V. Oh well. I guess that's that. I hope Tommy turns out well, man. Anyway, that's it for now. See you in the next one.